There's a saying that goes, everyone needs three hobbies. One that lets you be creative, one that keeps you in shape, and one that makes you money. Photography can be all three of these. In this video, we're talking about why photography is the best hobby. Let's get into it. Hey there, if you're new here, my name's Chris. I'm teaching you photography and how to start a creative business. I wanna say a special hi to all my new subscribers. Welcome to the channel. Today we're talking about why photography is the best hobby out there. Please drop a like below and let's get started. All right, going back to that saying from the beginning, everyone needs three hobbies. One that lets you be creative, one that keeps you in shape, and one that makes you money. You probably already know photography keeps you creative and can make you money, but how does it keep you in shape? Stay tuned and I'll explain. Photography is an awesome hobby if you wanna be creative. Unlike other art forms like painting or drawing, photography doesn't require the same technical skills to create the art. I'm not saying it's easy to take a good photograph, but all you need is your phone and your creative mind to visualize the scenes you wanna capture. Photography forces you to observe the world around you in ways you probably never have before. I've heard photography be called the art of observation before. I think that's a perfect description. In order to be creative and take beautiful photos, you have to be constantly observing your surroundings. If you're walking around the city and taking photos, what's happening around you? Are there people walking around? Are there cars in the street? Maybe there's pigeons eating some leftover hamburger on the sidewalk. Observing the elements around you and picturing in your head how they work together is huge in photography. As I walk around taking photos, I look at the colors around me. I look what colors match. I observe what people are doing and how they're interacting with their surroundings. Is there a car coming down the street that'll add some motion to the frame I'm trying to capture? Whenever I go out to take photos, there's always a million questions bopping around in my head. Photography is a great hobby because it lets you see the beauty in the world. It makes you notice things you otherwise would have overlooked. So many people go outside just to go from point A to point B, and they don't pay attention to anything around them. But put a camera in their hands, and all of a sudden they slow down and start to realize all that's happening around them. This is one of my favorite aspects of photography. Photography is also an awesome way to explore cities. Walking around and taking in all the details around you will make you feel as if you're part of that city. Your trips to new places will automatically become more memorable because you'll be able to take in your surroundings better. And now that you're a photographer, your memories from those trips will be captured in beautiful photos that you can go back to in the future. The second reason photography is a great hobby, photography keeps you in shape. I know you're not gonna be doing curls with your camera, even though those heavier camera bodies are gonna give you a good arm workout. Photography keeps you in shape by forcing you to explore cities and nature. When I go out photographing on a weekend, I can be outside for hours and get 10 or 20,000 steps in. I walk all around the city and I explore areas I otherwise would never go to. Walking around is a great way to stay healthy and photography is going to make you do that. If you're into landscape photography, chances are you're gonna to have to hike a lot for those awesome views. If you wanna be a landscape photographer, you're gonna get into good shape. Climbing mountains is not easy, but it's worth it for the views that you can capture. Now I'm not trying to compare photography to a hobby like running or weightlifting. Those are obviously gonna get you in amazing shape, but walking around is still better than sitting on your couch and watching Netflix. And finally, photography can make you money. I'm a full-time photographer running a production business. I do photography for a living. Photography has helped bring out the entrepreneur in me and create my own business. If I never got into this hobby, I wouldn't be where I am today. Now you don't have to be as intense as me and quit your job to make money in this. There are plenty of ways photographers can make money. You can just do a portrait session every weekend and make a few hundred dollars of extra income each week. Maybe you'll shoot a few weddings each summer and you'll make an extra 10 grand that year. Earning money from your side hustle feels so good. You might even realize you wanna start your own business and not work for someone else. Photography might be the driving force behind changing your life and going down the path of entrepreneurship. That was certainly my case. If you're thinking at all about this, please check out my video on starting a photography business in 2021. I go through all the steps you need in order to succeed. All right, last but not least, there's one big downside to photography. It can get really expensive. High-end cameras and lenses cost thousands of dollars. You need a good computer to process all those high-end images too. Photography can get expensive fast if you let it, but it doesn't have to be expensive. You can just start with your phone. If you learn the principles behind photography, you can make iPhone photos look really good. If you don't know where to start, check out my videos on beginner photography. That'll be a great first step in learning how to take better photos. If you do want to buy a beginner camera, I recommend the Sony a6000. For around 500 bucks, you really can't beat the value in it. I'll link it down below in the description. So those are the reasons why photography is a fantastic hobby. If you're on the fence and starting, just go outside with your phone and start taking photos. You'll know pretty soon whether you love it or you hate it. I appreciate you watching the video and I think it's awesome you want to learn more about photography. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. That really helps my channel and allows me to make more of these. All right, I'll catch you in the next one. Thank you.